For the past six years, flights have been made by a pair of X-29 aircraft from the desert lake bed at NASA's Dryden Flight Research Facility. This highly sophisticated experimental plane follows in the footsteps of the X series aircraft, which pushed the limits of speed, altitude, maneuverability, and fuel efficiency. Forward swept wings have only recently become practical with the advent of super strong composite materials that resist natural bending and twisting. The X-29 requires a new breed of aeronautical technology. Because its thin wings, close coupled canards, the smaller movable surfaces in front of the wings, and rear strake flaps make it naturally unstable in flight. A fail-safe triple redundant computer compensates for the instability by pulsing minute corrections, about 40 times each second to the controls, smoothing out any unstable effects. The computers are as necessary to fly the airplane as the hydraulic system is that actually moves the actuators. Steve Ishmael, one of the program's principal test pilots, has experienced the benefits of combining new interrelated technology into one airplane. It gets at another advance in technology where you see the interaction, for instance, between the canard and this forward sweep. And, and, that's, and that's very, very complex. Uh, and it varies as your angle of attack and your mock changes. Uh, that's part of the beauty and the, well, the art of designing airplanes. The advantage of a forward swept design is that air moving over the wing tends to flow inward rather than outward. This allows airflow to remain smooth around the wingtips and makes the X-29 easier to control in extreme maneuvers. It has exceeded predicted levels of maneuverability by flying at very high angles of attack, sometimes approaching 50 degrees. Most modern fighter jets have trouble handling anything in excess of 30 degrees. During the past six years, the X-29 has proven itself as a test bed for new ideas, including computer-controlled flight systems and the use of composites in wing construction. This highly successful flight test program will almost certainly influence future commercial and fighter aircraft, keeping the United States at the forefront of aviation.